Hey you all, I've been waiting for a break in the rain to do a video for you today and there has not been one so I'm going to go ahead and pull over in this dry spot here for a moment and do a video for you instead of skipping it. Alright, so February is Belief Month. Last week I talked about believing you can do the course. Today I want to talk about believing that you can do it under cutoff. This is one of the three things you have to believe to believe you can do finish the race. Alright, so um, I walk my clients through this in great detail. I walk my clients through what I talked about last week in, about the course in great detail. We walk it through for them specifically. We talk through scenarios. We do a lot of planning. And so they walk into the race calm. And I'm going to give you a kind of the overview in a quick video here for cutoff. The same stuff. So what I want you to do is take the race cutoff and the individual cutoff, aid station cutoffs, and map out back into that's your final answer that's worst case if you can't go any faster that's the minimum of what you have to do map take that answer and map back into the race of how you're going to make that happen that time or better and you'll see like a lot of people just look at that overall cutoff number and they say oh that's good or that's tight i'm uncomfortable with that and what I want you to do is take a step after that and look out, map out for yourself what that's going to look like in the race, how you're going to do that pace to hit that time or faster. OK, so don't just stop at that overall number and say, OK, I hope I can hit that. Like map out what that looks like for you. That's what I do with my clients. You can do that. All right. So that's today's part of the belief triangle that you need to believe to believe you can finish the race. Have fun with that. Um, and that's my tip. I will talk to you later. See ya.